Hello there, my fellow pirates. Uh, no screen behind me. Uh, it's being repaired. A couple rips. I uh, just wanted to do an update on a, another one of my favorite TV shows. I think I may have included this on a uh, on my favorite British shows, but once again, I want to go a little bit more in depth on it. And uh, it's the Prisoner. Patrick McGuhan. A uh, fabulous show. Only lasted, unfortunately, 17 episodes. Um, this is not the remake with Jim Caviezel. Even though I think there was a uh, advertisement in there for this. Uh, this is the Blu-ray. The special features disc which is uh, the last one, last one there, the bonus feature. That is, however, DVD. Uh, I remember some of the complaints that I was reading on Amazon were, this is a uh, high def. Uh, yeah, it's high def, just a special features disc is DVD. Big deal. Uh, you get fantastic stuff, though. You get all 17 episodes. You get a full feature-length documentary chronicling the production of The Prisoner, two brand-new featurettes, the promo for AMC's Prisoner miniseries, which I never saw, but I figure I'd seen this. I didn't have to. It was not going to be nearly as good as this. Um, newly restored versions of the Arrival episode. A music-only soundtrack, complete with an abandoned score. Very cool. Um, you get the original edit of the Chimes of Big Ben episode, which is fantastic. Trailers for all the episodes. Um, textless materials. Title sequence with clean themes. Uh, commercial break bumpers, an image archive with 1,200 stills, production paperwork archives, scripts, call sheets, press releases. Uh, this debuted in 1968, and it's basically, um, I'll read the back here. The masterful British TV series The Prisoner has captivated American audiences. Now E&E e -A -E presents a definitive aficionado's edition of the cult classic, which is considered one of the most innovative TV series ever filmed. For the first time in breathtaking... Blu-ray, fully restored from the original film elements with newly remixed 5.1 surround sound, hours of bonus materials never before released in America, creative vision of the late executive producer and star Patrick McGuhan. After resigning from a top-secret position, a man, McGuhan, is abducted and spirited away from his London home to a mysterious place known only as The Village. Village residents, known only by numbers, are held captive because each possesses valuable knowledge. The prisoner now known as Number Six, battles to protect his mind and his humanity while struggling to discover the identity of Number One and escape ca captivity. Just a fantastic, fun show. I wish it would have ran longer. I even have the little uh, obituary stuck in here when Patrick McGuhan died. January 15th, 2009, Thursday. Here's the article that I cut out. It gives you a little thing, kind of tells you about what each episode's about in here behind the nice blue shell. Uh, I also have uh, this book here. The Prisoner. This is really cool. A Barnes & Noble. Uh, which is really cool. Especially if you like this show. You get some pictures in it here and every page is, I mean, loaded with stuff. It's an episode guide. So it's your funeral episode. It gives you who wrote it, guest stars with, and directed by. And it gives you, you know, that one episode alone has three, four pages just for it. And they're all basically like that. Uh, it's a really cool book. I picked this up for $7 at my used bookstore. And uh, also, if you're into Patrick McGuhan, another fantastic show. This is before The Prisoner. This is Secret Agent, aka Danger Man. This is the complete collection, 86 episodes, 60 hours of quality TV. Uh, McGuhan plays Secret Agent John Drake. Um, it's, yeah, it's just a spy thriller. He solves crimes. Um, this is the original broadcast order from the original season that aired only in the UK as Danger Man to the 47 episodes of Secret Agent that were internationally shown, including two color episodes that provided a vivid finale to the long-running suspense thriller. 
You also get a biography on Patrick McGuhan, a filmography, complete full-length original U.S. opening, and a photo gallery. It's 18 discs. It's 57 hours of television. Once again, a &E, just like the Emma Peel one. Awesome. Fantastic. So, if you like spy shows, these shows here, the Avengers, check them out. They're worth having. They're worth owning. Get them. Watch them. They are awesome. Thank you for watching. Take care.